I think it's fair to say that the world would be a darker and drearier place without him. Yes. It's our great friend, Boy George. Yeah! I'm Get having out an out of body experience, and I know I always say this whenever I met you before. But I, you, 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 I had you on my bedroom door. Boy George, wow! Please. So you had a poster of George <laughs> on your wall. I had a poster, and I just used to. I was absolutely obsessed. I mean, Karma Chameleon was what 83, 82, 83? Yes. That's an extraordinary effort. And but you're I don't still think here. you think about that when you're doing it. You just go, no. oh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, that's what happened then. You don't think, oh, in like 30 years' time, I'm going to be talking about this. And yeah. You know what I mean? It's yeah. quite weird. <laughs> well, listen, we're here to talk about your brand new book. It's called Karma. It's out now. I mean, karma means different things, I guess, to different people, does it? What action does it, what does it is mean? the word. Karma means action. That's it. Oh. And so the book is like a kind of reflection on what you've learned over your... Or, or, because what? it's been about people, <laughs> about myself, telling stories in a you know matter-of-fact way. You know, just as I say, you know, we, mm. when you're doing it yourself, you never think it's weird. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? You just think, oh, yeah, it's... And then Amanda, someone points it you on TV out. As Frank Sinatra... Prince wants to meet you. Hi, Prince. He's just a person. You're, you know? always, you're always quite honest, but you're also very aware of, uh, you know, you're very image aware. Are there things that you just think, I can't, I, I don't want to share that, or that's not going in because I'm worried about how, what that people might perceived. think of me. I yeah. love that you think I'd tell you, though. <laughs> 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 it's like, I'm the, I can change him. I can, I can be the one. No, I think that, you know, of course, we're all sort of very selective about what we remember. Yeah, we are definitely. I mean, whenever Marilyn tells me a story, she's always wearing a cape. Mm. She's always like, I'm the hero. <laughs> it's always like, when, I don't remember you, but, uh, but yeah. it's like people remember things as they want to. And yeah, I think as long as you do it with a sense of humour, it's you know, the I mean, humour. I think it's the most important thing. Let's not lose that. Like me and Madonna are never going to be mates. It's over. It's too late. Right. So I'm just going to say what I think of her. <laughs> Aren't you worried? Which is what everybody says anyway. <laughs> but aren't you worried about what she's going to say when she finds out? I hope she, no, I hope she writes something about me, but she wouldn't. I, she won't mention me. <laughs> but it, the, the reason why I mention it is because <laughs> I, I don't know if you've seen any of the Robbie documentary that's I on. Have. I said if he wrote Karma Chameleon, he might have a hit in America. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. <laughs> but it's an interesting, because it got me thinking. It's like, well, you know, the thing is, Karma Police yeah. would never have been allowed had it not been for Creep. Right, there's that's no way. Radio that, so head, you always yeah. need the karma mm. chameleon before you have the luxury of going karma police. So actually, you got it all wrong. Mm. I think, think you always got to say what you feel at the time. It doesn't matter. Like karma chameleon is like the most insane song. Well, mm. yeah, because what's that about? Well, it's about karma as in yeah. action. Chameleons being a creature that changes their colours. You know, they can kind of adapt to their surroundings. Yeah, basically, it's about closets. <laughs> I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to... Here today, gay tomorrow, <laughs> gone tomorrow, gay today. You know, that kind of thing. Right? I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. Kicks off. Uh, it's back again on Sunday. Happy memories for you for, for last time round or not, sir? Hilariously, because mm. I've got this ability to do things and then completely forget about them. Oh, I do stuff like that all the time. All the time. I walked out of the jungle, went in to get checked up by the doctor, looked at the screens. I went, I know I was just in there. But don't remember and they said, that. don't eat anything. I had about 65 pizzas. I had lots of coffee. I just ate so much food. They said, you won't feel well. I was like, rubbish. <laughs> I'm just going to eat whatever I can get my hands on. <laughs> what was funny about the jungle, I think, is that when you're in there, they make it you feel like you're in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, what does it feel like you for real? You are in the middle of nowhere, but actually, just across the bridge, there's like a cafe <laughs> and there's... <laughs> <laughs> What I love about George, and whenever he talks up, about you, the jungle, he just he always ruins, ruins it, it for the production. He ruins he goes, the magic. <laughs> Have you seen this year's lineup? No, but I'm going to watch it because I, I know what they're it. going through. So oh, I'm like, God, come on, I'm going to know how miserable. Because you start off thinking, I'll be fine. Yeah. After four days of no salt and no, like, the water thing was the oh, big thing. Oh, God, yeah. I actually got well, them to change having... the filter. <laughs> I kicked off so bad, they put a filter on the thing so we didn't have to boil the water anymore. Yeah, because you could get all kinds of parasites I kicked off. I was like, I haven't enough of this stinking water thing. And, and they were the like, toilet. They said, what you signed up for? I said, no, I didn't sign up for that at all. No, you didn't. The <laughs> best thing of the whole thing was when Matt Hancock said to me, because I was trying to cause a mutiny about something, we weren't getting chocolate. And I was like, let's kick off. Let's take our mics off. Let's just tell them no. And he said, they'll send us home. <laughs> he said, they sent everyone from Coach Trip home. I said, this isn't Coach Trip. <laughs> 
brought us in on the helicopters. Because they, how much money do you think was going to cost them to get rid of us all? So I was like, let, they wouldn't do it though. Nobody was brave. Karma is available everywhere now. Yes, you can get absolutely. it. Waterstones, Amazon, everywhere. Put it on your Christmas list. Yes, it's an excellent stocking filler, and I'm going to get mine signed because that would be good karma. Exactly. If it was free and signed. I never said no. Boy George! This is hard.